hillside road. I want to place this pixel scale list of video footage once again and to place this video footage you have to use a drag and drop method once again and I am placing this video footage once again for comparing between before and after. So question is what is vibrance and saturation in Adobe Premiere Pro? Saturation is the intensity of color and vibrance is a smart tool that increases the intensity of muted color. So where you will get the vibrance and saturation option? You will get it inside the creative tab. So this is the creative tab and let me expand it. And to expand you just have to click on the creative tab and here is the vibrance and saturation option. So let's start with the vibrance. As you know, vibrance is using for increase the intensity of muted color. And if you want to increase the intensity of muted color, then you have to move this vibrance pointer at right. Then the point of vibrance will be increased. Right now we have zero point. So let me show you by increasing the vibrance. And if we increase the vibrance, then we will have the active green color for our hill. So let me move this pointer at right. Okay, right now I have 80.5 point and you can take a look we have some good and active green color for our hills and if you want to compare between before and after applying the vibrance then you just have to place this indication bar at our second video footage. This is the before and this is the after. Before, after. After applying the vibrance, we have a very good and active green color for our hills. And if you want to decrease the intensity of muted color, then you just have to move this pointer at left. So let me move this pointer at left. And you can take a look, we don't have the active green color for this hills and it's not really looks good. So I think we have to keep plus point right now we have minus 68 point and all the good or active green color is gone and to enable this you just have to move this vibrance pointer at plus side or right side so let me move this pointer at right side as like before 80.5 point and we have the very good and active green color for this hills so you learned about the vibrance and let's start with the saturation. As you know, saturation is the intensity of color and if you want to increase the intensity of entire color, then you have to increase the saturation. If you want to increase the green intensity of the entire video footage, then you have to increase the saturation. So let me show you how it will look like after increasing the saturation. And to do that, you just have to move this saturation pointer at right. Okay, you can take a look right now. We have more green and more active green color for these hills. And if you want to compare between before and after, you just have to place this indication bar at our second video footage. This is the before, this is the after. Before, after and you can take a look we have more an active green color for this video footage and if you want to decrease the saturation then you have to move this saturation pointer at left so let me move this pointer at left and this is the preview after decreasing the saturation and i'm pretty sure you are not going to like this so i want to keep this saturation at right Okay, I want to go for 177 point and now it really looks good. So let's compare for the last time. So you just have to place this indication bar at here at our second clip. This is the before, after, before, after. We have the perfect green color for this hill part and if you compare the long hill from here, you can compare if you place the indication bar. For the second one, we don't have the actual or the perfect view for this long hill. 
and if you place the indication mark after applying the vibrant and saturation we have the perfect and active color for the long hair so this is the vibrance and saturation in Adobe Premiere Pro for increasing decreasing the intensity of color and 